Did Werner von Braun secretly make the V-2 rocket less deadly? The V-2 was the world's first long-range missile. It could fly at five times the speed of sound and travel 300 kilometers, but it wasn't very accurate. If two rockets aimed at London, one might land within 20 kilometers of the target and the other could miss completely. Why was it so off-target? There were three main reasons. First, guidance. The rocket used gyroscopes and an early computer, but it had no way to correct its path at the end. Small mistakes turned into big misses. Second, manufacturing. The rockets were built with slave labor in terrible conditions at the Mittelbau Dora concentration camp, so quality was poor. Third, the limits of 1940s science. There was no GPS, no digital computers, and no precise navigation yet. Von Braun and his team tested new ideas like radio control, beam riding, and even joystick steering. These could have made the rocket much more accurate, maybe within a few kilometers. So did Von Braun hold back on purpose? It seems like he was racing to make a more accurate rocket. Supporters think maybe he slowed down, knowing Germany was losing the war. After all, he was even arrested late in the war for making defeatist comments. What do you think?